Six people are dead, four of them children, the youngest just two and a half months old. The crime has shocked the sleepy Ottawa suburb of Barhaven where the crime happened. Police say the father, the only survivor of the tragedy, is in hospital in stable but serious condition. We have arrested and charged a 19-year-old male, Frank D'Souza, with six counts of first-degree murder and one count of attempted murder. The accused is a Sri Lankan national who is believed to have been in Canada as a student. I'll, emph I'll emphasize he is the only suspect. The victims included a 35-year-old mother, Darshani, and her four children, 7-year-old Inuka, 4-year-old Ashwini, 2-year-old Rinyana, and Kelly, just two and a half months old, born in Canada. Also killed an acquaintance of the family, 40-year-old Americone Gamini Americone. The Sri Lankan High Commission confirms all were Sri Lankan nationals, police saying the family themselves only arrived recently. The husband especially, I can say that, uh, you know, I've seen him, I've talked to him many times, and the, the guy with the big smile and uh, uh, big helpers in the community, in the temple especially, when there, whenever there's an event happening, he would come and he would help. Uh, and they've, you know, seen the kids at the temple as well. So again, uh, one that's like a kind-hearted man. Police were called to the Ottawa suburb just before 11 Wednesday night after receiving several calls of a bloody man screaming and asking people to call 911. Police say when they arrived, they soon discovered the six deceased and took the father to hospital. When I came out, that's what is happening. And then the, the guy was yelling and then the police, uh, two police people, that's, you know, no, he was able to walk. He was able, so then they just, uh, you know, carried him and then put him in a car or the ambulance. The suspect, also a Sri Lankan national, is believed to have been rooming with the family along with the 40-year-old victim. Police say the suspect, family and household were unknown to them prior to this incident, which Ottawa's police chief says may be the worst mass murder in city history. I said, oh my God, in my own street, just across the street, this major tragedy has happened. That too with the four little kids, it's, uh, it's not right. In Ottawa, Shao Lee, City News.